Hi there and welcome to Loki Collectibles. Many thanks for watching this video. If you have you know, followed the link on my website and you just want to know what these are really. Basically, Air Combat Collection or a fortnightly um, publication. And every every two weeks, sorry, you'd get a model plane, you know, one in hundred scale model plane. They're usually made by Utelery. You'd get one of these models and you'd get a magazine as well telling you all about it. What this video basically is, is on our website, what we do is a lot of people sell these models and forget to include the magazines. So as a service, we don't really even make any money from it, but we just do it as a service. We have some back issues of magazines, and anyone who might be missing a magazine or something like that, we possibly might have it in stock on our website. So this is the Air Combat Collection, and these are some of the magazines we had in stock, and just to show you some of the planes they did, really. Right, this was issue 23. And it featured the F-16 Fighting Falcon. And as you can see, these were the type of models you'd get. So that's that one for that one. This one's quite a cool one. An MI-24 Hind, the Devil's Chariot. And that was the model you'd get with that one. Quite cool. And there's this one here, issue 22. And with that one, you got the Mitsubishi Zero. This one here, issue 21. So hopefully this tells you a bit, you know, if you want to know some of the models as well and what numbers there were. Issue 21 was the Northrop F5 Tiger II. Um, this one here. Quite cool. i got a feeling that was for the Spitfire. Yep, Submarine Spitfire, and that's issue 7. Um, this one here, issue 14. I think this was their MiG-29 Fabulous Fulcrum, which is, there it is. Yep, this one was one of the nicest models in the range. Um, this one here, the A10 Thunderbolt 2, and there's what the one you got with that, the North American P51 Mustang, that was issue 13. Here we have issue number 12, and with this one you got a Lockheed F104 Starfighter. This one here came with the F15 Eagle, it's issue 8. And that's the model you got, and that one was a really cool model. This one here is, I know it's for an Apache type of plane. Anyway, you see 31, and that is the MiG-17 you got with it. This one here, issue 32. Right, that is the one which you got the helicopter with. The Bell H AH AH-1 Cobra. So that was issue 32. So, you know, they did planes, helicopters, modern aircraft, old aircraft, you know, quite a diverse collection of models they did. Um, this one here, the seat cap Jaguar, issue 29, this one was a nice model, I do like that one. So that was that one. Issue 28 here, and you got the Hawker Tempest, so a nice World War II one with that one. Right, issue 25 here, and you got the Messerschmitt ME262 with that one, it's a cool German World War II plane. This one here, issue 9, the BAEC Harry, I believe. Yes, that's a really nice model. Um, issue 30 here, and that one was the Curtis P40 Warhawk. Nice colour scheme on that one. It looks more like an English plane, but it is an American. Yeah, the Panavert Tornado, this was issue 1, and this was probably the best model in the, in the collection. There's that one there. This one here, issue number two. Again, you got a really nice plane. And my argument is that's probably the best as well. So issue one and two probably had the best planes in there. This was the McDonnell F4J Phantom 2. Issue number three, you got the Grumman F14 Tomcat. Issue number four, you got the Junkers JU87 Stucker. This one here, issue 5, you got a cool Apache helicopter, AH-64 Apache. For some reason, some of those were flying around my house the other week. Uh, <laughs> did scare the missus a little bit. Um, issue 6 here, the Dissel Raphael came with that one. Issue 10 here, we got the Voice F-18 Crusader. See, they're nice planes, they come on nice plaques. The only weird thing about this collection is there are one in a hundred scale, which was a bit weird. Um, a bit small. Um, there we go, that one. Issue 16 here. The Void F4U Corsair. Issue 26 here. 
we have the Dassault Mirage 2000 with that issue. I'm not quite sure how many planes are in this, but hopefully this gives you a little idea as a checklist and you know you can see what numbers you've got. Cluster Meteor, that one, and that was issue 24. The issue 19 here is the Messerschmitt BF109. Issue 27, what do we have? The Douglas A4 Skyhawk, that was a nice plane. Um, 18, we've got the Dissault Mirage 3, so that's issue 18. Issue 17 here, we have the, I can never say this, so please apologise, the Fog Wolf FW190. That was my attempt to say it anyway without swearing. Issue 15 here is the North American F86 Sabre. So, they're the magazines you got with the Air Combat Collection. So, anyone's missing a, a magazine or something like that, check out Loki Collectibles. I think we charge about 40 pence each if anyone's missing any of these and you want a complete collection. Um, I will try and show you just quickly. Basically, the magazines there were for, not for these big planes here, they were for these ones here. That was actually a subcat there, so they're quite nice. These ones there are the Atlas Editions. And there's actually the Apache one I told you, a bit dusty. But they were for these small planes. But as you can see, they're the Atlas Editions, which are 1 in 72. But some of the planes in the collection were quite nice. Right, anyway, and there's some, some more of the ones out of the collection. So, fortunately, these ones, there they all are. They're actually the ones for the magazines, you can see. Um, anyone need any of these, as I say, magazines, please check out LokiCollectibles.com. And we can see what we can do for you. Many thanks for looking. Bye-bye.